Hey guys, Natasha with the Day with Ethel vlog. All right, you know my goal this year. I am going to read authors that are on my to be read list and I'm going to devour them. Lo and behold, this story is I bought as a book and I also did the Audible because I was doing housework. I needed something to keep me going and cleaning the house, which is undoing. Let me tell you, That Guy by Kim Jones gave me everything. It is hilarious. And I think it all has to do with Penelope Hart. Penelope Hart is fabulous. Like this girl cracks me up because she's in Chicago and she's going to do right by her best friend. Her best friend's heartbroken over her boyfriend. And so what does Penelope do? Penelope's gonna go and get dog shit, and light it on fire and put it on his doorstep. Lo and behold, she gets chased trying to find the dog crap. It's hilarious. She jumps in a car to save herself, kind of gets stuck in a world, and ends up at a penthouse. This penthouse happens to be that guy, the guy that she's been wanting to write. She's an author, and she's just trying to find that guy. Sure enough, he is that guy. This is Jake Swagger. Come on, his name fits it. He does have swagger. He kind of has this personality that's mysterious like you want more of him you want to see where jake's gonna go and he keeps kind of everything at a distance and he doesn't really divulge so he's a complete mystery which makes it even better but when he's with penelope like she brings out so much like sometimes he wants to throttle and then turn around and kiss her passionately and it's fun to see how penelope really kind of gets under everybody's nerves in a good way. She kind of brings out things that need to be brought out and you kind of you enjoy how she brings humor, she brings sexy, and she just brings this beautiful essence to this to these guys. Ultimately, you got Jake and Jake's grandfather, which I love Jake's grandfather. Like I would love to go have a burger with him, chicken wings and a beer because he just brings normalcy. Yes, they're the rich and they're very famous but they're also, they put their pants on just like you and I. And as you read it, you see that Penelope brings that out in Jake when he's trying to get this deal with this irrigation company. Her honesty and her raw beauty just brings everybody to a hurt. Like she is the person that you wanna to flock to because she doesn't know that she's doing all these amazing things naturally. She's just a natural person in situations and Jake has to work at that. He has to, you know, dive into information to find out what makes these people tick. Penelope just looks at him and she just knows and that piques Jake's interest. But ultimately, Jake gets more vested in Penelope. He sees that this inner beauty person is the person that he enjoys to talk to, to like explain what's going on in his life and make him laugh. And you just, you chuckle throughout the story because you see how these guys just bring out humor. And the only thing Penelope wants is chicken wings and a beer. Just give her that and that girl is smitten but ultimately it's Jake that makes her smitten. And in every heroine story, the heroine has to really kind of fight for her alpha hero male. And she is in her inner monologue, it's hilarious because she makes you, you're thinking that even in your own life, you are saying those same things and you're agreeing with your, you are agreeing with everything Penelope says because we all want that guy to come and rescue it. We all want that guy to be, you know, the Julia Roberts moments and Pretty Woman. Guys, this is that guy. Go get the Audible, go get the reading of it because you will truly enjoy it because there's so much fun, sexy banter throughout the story. And Kim Jones now is going to be a must read for me. And I'm so pissed I never read her stuff before. But I do want to say something. Jake says this and it kind of is, brings the essence of the story in my opinion. That mouth of yours, Penelope Hart, will be my demise because she's not afraid to tell you what she's thinking. But does she forget to tell somebody when she's ultimately needing more? And that's what's fun about this story. Guys, go get it. It's in the links. It's worth the read. It's worth the listen. Come on. I got my house cleaned in eight hours. Go get the book. Talk to you later.